So this poem I'm going to share is called Upon the Sand. Okay. We'd imagined God's wrath would jolt us, pyrotechnic show-stopping apocalypse commanding our attention. So we missed the subtle sea striving, the slow rotting away of root and branch. We slept through days of should have been decision, opting out of a greater vision and into the rhythm pounding like the waves of the sins of each generation argued over where to build the walls of a house, never noting the feeling of the sand beneath our feet. The part where it crashes down isn't climax, it's epilogue. So I hope that sometimes if we take a moment to rest with that vague feeling of discomfort, it can mature into a, a wake-up call and, and a call to vision rather than just compounding into this despair. Okay. You know, it seems like part of the challenge that we all face is that we're masters of displacing responsibility. So when our life starts to take a turn for the worse, it's, we explain it in other ways than to look inward to say, where do I need to make some adjustments here? And, and maybe major changes. We do that every Sunday, we have a sacrament meeting. We partake of the sacrament. We get a chance to reflect on ourselves. And not that we need to beat ourselves up, but it's a time of evaluation. It's a time of reflection. It's a time of, there are a couple of things I need to do differently this week. 